Hey there everyone, this is Al Cal playing ASMT, and I guess today we're starting World 3! 40 lives, is that gonna be enough? Because we're in the sky world, the first level is this place. Sky is fine, high sky, high blind. I blight for miles. Uh, uh, yeah, it's got piling music. And it's like, our clouds are known for video games. It's pretty rad. So, yeah, ye old dip style high, uh, high flight level. Something you only ever encounter, like, in Super Endgame in a certain Vivity series. Here present in World 3, right at the start, make no bones about it. We don't need them, we have enough bones as it is. Uh, well, alright, that went alright. Hey, that's a feather graphic. Is it a popcorn kernel? Is it a butterfly? Believe in your heart of heart. Check it out, we are now at the plumber's drive. Uh, we shall soar through the air. Demos, high flight graphic. It's really nice. It has, uh, the, ooh, watch out for soccer balls. Uh-oh, yeah, see? Uh, there's a way to get back up from there, but I didn't do it correctly. Flight, you know, like, flight, I, I have grown to really like smooth flight mechanics, but they are weird. Uh, they are very awkward more often than not, and they're kind of hard to use correctly. But man, when they work, they work. Like, that's just the reality of it. There we go, let's try this again. Maybe this time I want to go less fast? Well, if I'm going to pull that stunt, yeah, like, I gotta make sure that I can at the very least clear this first. Watch out for soccers. It's footballs, but for Europe. There you go. I cleared it now. I went at the right speed, at the right angle, at the right time of year, during the right season, during snowfall. Look at that guy bouncing around. What a fool. Oh, there's a secret exit. I can't believe my knees. I never trust them. Whenever I go to the grocery, I'm like, hmm, I wonder what I'm forgetting I'm supposed to buy. If my knees offer to help, I know to refuse splendidly. That's the word we're gonna use here. There's a secret exit. The sky fly, by fly, fly, banana bread tree. Do you know where to find it? In the cashew department. That is incorrect. But thank you for trying. Alright, there's a down arrow. Whoa, you go down wherever it says to go down. And you're gonna win a prize! Oh, there's a secret alternate pathway here through. Giant bullet, there's a room parade, there's a rooftop parade. Uh, Charlie, that was not very useful, now I think I'm dead. Because I'm expect to still fly. Maybe I can bounce on this guy. Make it further than I'm allowed, yeah that's not gonna happen. So this might be the hard part a little, but I already beat it, so I can start select. It's not a death, it's not a demo, it's nothing! Oh shoot, well it's, it's fine if you mess it up. Because you can just fly back up through here. Like, it's, it's very easy, it's fine, you're gonna be okay. So I feel like you kind of... Is that a little Akitu in there? Maybe. Alright, so this time I maintained my flight. Everything is okay. Be careful about these guys. Be careful about these guys. Whoa, see this is funny? Because it's just like the box gets in the way in the hopes that you make a mistake and die. But there's also a ground here, so it's a relatively safe place to pull that prank. Prank acknowledgement! Uh, flurb. Well, there you go. Don't do that. Ah, man. Alright, this might be... How would you turn around? Wait, how would you turn around? 
How did- what? Wait, what? What? Putting an auto message on a level, you're probably gonna restart a lot. Sure was a super great decision. expect to live through that one. I think that was obvious that I didn't think I lived through that one. Oh, jeez. Uh, okay. It's Charlie's, man. Also, this level only gives you 200 Mario time units. Dude. Like, it kinda expects you to die at the midpoint, but the secret exit path does not have a midpoint. Ah, oh, man, I mess it up, I mess it up, I mess it up. Maybe I can still do it. Maybe I can do it. Ah, I landed on a pin. Oh, and that's fine, because I'm basically there, though. Here's a key, here's a Dagadon. You go in the pipe that has the coins on it, and then you return to this pub space. There we go, with all the Goopas and the Sloopas and the Koopas and the Moopas. It's fine, get hit. It's fine. It's fine. There we go. Hey, a level where I was threatened. Ugh. Man. It's... I kind of don't know how long I've played. Let's do Charles Outhouse. I know the secret exit, I believe, leads to a... Uh, it's called... I don't know why it's called Outhouse, because it's a ghost house, I guess. It uses, like... Slopes. Which is weird. Oh yeah, no, yeah, here we go. Video game video, video go. Uh, I am playing too quick though. Oh, look at that guy up there. Uh, everyone remembers my reaction to this little cutie. And it created a meme of its own. Charlie's inside the home. Playing the saxophone. With his trombone, I don't know what that means, but that's okay. You get a key like this, I guess. But I can't really do anything with it now, I guess. Huh, yeah, cause you need to bring it in there. Okay, well I guess we're not done. I'm gonna go at a place I don't get, I guess. I'm just saying I guess a lot. Bounce at that guy and have some fun. Oh man, that kind of looks like a door, but also that, oh no, what's the floor? I forgot actually where you want to go, because there's a few chances of where you want to go, but I know it's not over there. Yeah, it's the kind of thing where you press a piece, which you're like, well, what's the room you want to go in? I don't know, man. Take a chance. Charlie, slim around. Let's try here. I honestly forgot. Yo, check it, we're here, and the silver pea appeared, I wonder what that means, yo, check it out, I have a key, check it out, that guy is money, that's pretty weird, unless you think about it for three seconds in history, don't even know what that means, check it out, the laser, oh my geez, it's kind of in the way though. So, here we go. Like, this place doesn't expect you to have pressed the P-Switch. Even though to get here, you need to have immediately pressed the P-Switch. I just don't think a lot of thought was put into it. But that's fine! It's cute! Oh, look at that! It's a switch Well, let's do normal exit first. It just makes it easier on the video annex. But if you, you kind of do the whole level again, basically. Like, it's... it's... It's it's one of those hey so you know normal exit and the uh, regular exit and also the normal one that you get they all kind of stem from the same path 
So what you gonna do about it is what they say. Nothing really is really the only answer you can give. Let's be honest. What you can do is limit it. You find a platform, but you rub a belly and you pain for that. You get hurt for that. Bounce on a head for that. To get that moon, you gotta like just jump in there, like like whoosh. But man, it's risky. Like it is a risky jump. I'm trying it here for fun, but I might regret. It. Yeah, I didn't regret it. But I, so I understand the idea of it being three beats together, because green beats are one up. You know, it's a three up. I, I feel like the three beat corn cob. It's just not as charismatic as a moon, though. Like, it's 3B. It's clever in a way. Like, it's very obvious. I don't know, though. It, 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 there's, there's like a, a certain pizzazz that is missing. And when you're at the point where you are complaining about a lack of pizzazz and <laughs> sprite replacement, what are you doing with your life? Well, you bounce on this guy. Uh, I'm not sure what path I want to follow here. I guess I'm going downwards. Alright, it's the path I took. It gives me 24 stars. Now I can walk on this rotten wood and see the stars. Cause we are in the clouds. We are in the clouds. Look at that. I remember this level being kind of a something. I'm actually gonna stop at- uh, we're, we're, we're limiting ourselves to three levels today. This level is just like a whole bunch of back and forth. You go at a place, and you go on down, then you go to Mr. Brown. Alright, so this one- so see the puzzle is... You gotta make yellow guy dance! He loves to dance. But he needs to dance in the right direction. Tyrannical dance! Alright, I've unlocked the pathway for me to follow. Inside this big old rectangle It's a megaphone for rectangles. Well, I can't do much here now at, at all. Gonna have to continue. I believe you're gonna make him do that. You get a P-switch. Well, how about that? Then you do that. Oh my gosh, it's a Yoshi. Did you ever hear about such a crazy thing? I could just take a hit and go up there and do things. What I want, we'll do this properly. Whoa, put an object inside Yoshi's mouth, and it's inside Yoshi's mouth. Never before unforeseen circumstances. Gemini. Alright, you gotta do this. You got this. Springy boardy. Or, as they call it in Australia, springboard, probably. There's no reason the word would be any different. But you can't take a chance in this day of night, and so you're going to fly, all right. And just in case Yoshi gets hungry, because, you know, this is how he relates to the world. There you go. I knew you couldn't just get stuck there. That'd be silly. Uh, I just don't trust Yoshi to not start to swallow a big weird plastic object inside his mouth. There it goes! But see, I could've just tanked that very easily. This is not a brute force proof puzzle in any way, shape, or size. But we can believe, and we can try. It's a thing! I didn't press the button, I think I pressed the button too late. I am very darn gosh sure that too late is the point of failure here. It's gonna happen sometimes, you know? You press a button, you press another button, you just never know what's gonna happen. Demo went there on her own. Like, she was like, Welp, I'm done on this strange green thing. I'm out of here. I'm gonna dance on top of this house. The music's pretty good. It's just not as, as dancey as the woods theme, but it's still pretty good. This is a song that has returned in my mind zone multiple times. Especially this, like, upcoming part, where it goes like, see where the other instrument kicks in? It's so dreamlike. Dreamlike? Dreamlike. A very successful piece of music, as far as I'm concerned. And everyone I know depends on me to determine what's a successful piece of music. That hill, it goes, like, way high. What up with that guy? 